we are living in the beginning of a mass extinction. Earth has been in existence for the last 4.5 billion years. Mankind has existed on Earth for the last 140,000 years. To put that in perspective, if you condense the Earth's lifespan into 24 hours, that's one full day, then we humans have been on this planet for three seconds. During our short time on Earth, we have contributed to our climate breaking down, our biodiversity declining, our forests and wildlife disappearing, our oceans being poisoned and our entire ecosystem degrading. Our planet is sick and we humans are responsible. So what can we do to change this? What can you do to change this? To survive, we need to stop burning fossil fuels. We must commit to reducing our energy consumption across our offices and factories and be 100% balanced by renewable energy. But this alone will not be enough. We need to plant as many trees to balance and neutralize the carbon footprint. A tree is an example of a natural climate solution. Mangroves, jungles, marshes, seabeds, coral reefs, they all take carbon out of the air and lock it away. These natural climate solutions could make a massive difference to repair our broken climate and improve biodiversity. We must also eliminate consumption and manufacture of single-use plastic, which is the biggest polluter of our oceans. We only recycle 9% of all plastic. That means that unless it's been burned, every single piece of plastic ever made still exists on our planet. We can also contribute and support small farmers and local produce to help them eliminate food wastage, which is a major challenge that we are facing today. As corporations or businesses, we must care about the world we leave behind us. We are now seeing a real increase in the number of collaborations and partnerships, creating extraordinary coalitions and setting ambitious targets to get us on the right path. Sustainable development is the way of the future. We must be able to satisfy our needs without adversely affecting our natural resources. Many large organizations have already created plastic-free regions, turned completely carbon neutral and pledged to operate only on clean energy, have successfully set up e-vehicle charging stations in the campuses to promote low carbon transportation, have deployed end-to-end -end waste management processes and effective recycling of food waste from local vegetable markets. Of course, no company can solve a challenge of this magnitude alone, which is why we urge each one of you to do your part, to leave a lasting, positive impact on the planet that our future generations will inherit. It is the choices we make today that will make a difference going forward. The greatest threat to our planet is the belief that someone else will save it. Be that someone.